Hey guys, Jamel's Ninja here, and in this video, I want to do a quick little walkthrough through the recently released Steam version of Pop Tropica. I was wondering what it was, so I want to do a quick little informational video showing what it's all about and what it gives access to. So, the first thing I noticed when you open it up, you need to install something like Adobe Air. It's called Adobe Air and it should tell you the site to go to to install it to open the game. It's $20 on Steam. I'll put a link in the description for that. And when you open it up, you'll be able to log into your account like normal. And it is different. It's like an older version of what Pop Tropica used to be. I s this home island is different, like it's the old look. If you go to your inventory, that's different. You know, you got access to realms. This is like older stuff from my inventory that I don't have in the current version. Which is really nice to see again, I won't lie. Some of this stuff kind of brings me back. Now, the map. Alright, you got Arabian Nights, all three episodes. Snaggle Mask is there. Not 24 Carry, Pop Tropicon, Survival, and it says I did the first two episodes, as you've seen in the recent videos, so it's all connected. Escape from Pelican Rock, Timmy Failure, Time Tangle, Mythology, Reality TV, Wild Safari, Mission Atlantis, Mystery of the Map. Galactic Hot Dog String Gray, Virus Hunter, Pachapas Games, Monster Carnival, and Mock Tropica. Oh, it's so nice to see. I will be bringing you all the content I can for this, but this was more of a short, shorter informational video to show you what's going on here. But I will be bringing you the islands over the coming days so stay tuned and I will see you all soon peace